Hey everybody, Dave here. Today we're gonna dive into the second part of this video because I wanted to show you how I made my slides for my summer school class. Just a quick recap, we are in ChatGPT. If you haven't seen that other video, please check it out, it's pretty cool. And I have a three week media arts class that I teach every summer to upcoming high school kids and actually high school students that are there now. And we crack, we just kick butt in three weeks that takes a whole semester to do. And I love it because the kids are focused and we get through a lot of creative stuff and it's so much fun. So I just finished that, but I realized I didn't show you how I made my day one slides. And I think that's a really important part of this whole video series that I did. So once again, we were in ChatGPT. I wanted to teach a three week summer school class. I didn't want to do what I do every year. So I wanted to refresh it and uh, it dove in and gave me some information. I gave it specifics that I'm looking at teaching and it created an outline in UDL format. And here it all is. And then I asked it to make lesson plans that I could share with the students. And I put that all here. From eight to nine, we're gonna do this. From nine to 10, we're gonna do that. So I followed this to a T and it was flawless. We did all of it. It worked out great. The timing was great. I mean, everything. So kudos to uh, ChatGPT for helping me out this summer. I'm gonna slide down here. So I did all of that. Everything was ready to go, but I wanted to have an outline. Of, I make a slide deck based on everything. So I did all that. It made the slides for me and I was ready to go. So now, I want to jump into Canva. So I'm going to take this first one here where it says, welcome to an introduction to media art. So I'm going to copy that and we're going to go into Canva and you're going to want to create a new document and inside the document, once you start it up, here's your new document. I'm going to do right here. And I'm going to actually press command V introduction to media arts. There it is. And then I'm going to press enter once. And that lets me change to my content. So this big writing here is called header one. So you want to make sure header one is your size here. And then the one below it is going to be your content. Just leave it default when you press enter. So I'll press enter again. And if I click it once here though, you can see it's saying, do, what do I want? Do I want header one, subheader, sub -header, body, etc." cetera. So we're just gonna leave it default. And that's going to be that right there. I'm going to go back into chat for a second. I'm going to take this here. I'm going to press command C. I think I missed a Y, but we'll fix it. Press command V and we'll put the Y right there. So welcome to media arts. This is your, uh, introductory journey, uh, your journey into mobile video creation. Okay. Then I'm going to press enter again, and I'm going to make sure that this says heading. So heading. And then I'm going to go back to chat and look for my second slide, which says course overview. Okay. So there's the course overview. We'll go back in here, press command V. Then I enter one more time and then you just keep going down the list. I'm not going to do them all because I did it already. And I wanted to show you how I did it. So let's go down here. Here it is in my Canva. Everything is spilled out the way I wanted it. And it looks good. So now the next thing I wanted to do is turn this into a presentation. So I'm going to go here, magic switch up here and convert to a presentation. And this is going to turn it into a slide deck for me. And it's awesome. So let's click that now. Do I want to see this again? Welcome to docs to decks. They call it. It's great. You can keep it up. I always just keep things up in case I forget something. I'm going to do that. And now it's going to let me figure out what I want as far as they only give you so many templates, but you can kind of tweak them. So it's nice. And this is one of them here. So I'm actually just going to use this blue one here because we're blue and white. So I'm going to go create presentation. And then here is all my slide decks ready to go. If I want to, I can go back to chat. And if you looked at the first video, I showed you how to do this, how to create, how to create these images. So I just downloaded that image right there, but these are all the images it made based on this slide deck. Actually, we'll do that first one too. And we'll go back into our slides, which went here. And maybe on this one, I want to go into camera upload. 
and then I'm going to upload files and we'll take this first one here and now maybe I'll drag it over here and make it smaller. And there's my first slide with a little image that I didn't have to go find. It made for me, uh, Dolly got the writing correct. So it says, welcome to introduction to media arts. And here's all your slides right here. And all you have to do is go to the top here where it says present, and then it'll open up on your screen to present. If you need to want to share this with your kids so they can have a copy of it, you just go to share and then download right here. And then you're going to download it as a PDF. And then you can upload it to um, Google Classroom or Schoology or whatever you're using. But that's it. It's ready to go. I'm ready to present. It's such an easy workflow. I hope that you got some value out of this. I have, if so, please do me a favor, give it a like, leave a comment, and also please subscribe to my channels as I'm trying to grow this and just really spread what I'm using in class so that other teachers can just crank things out. Or you can be a corporate person doing this, so it doesn't have to be just teachers. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed it today. I'm David Basulto. Hope you're having a great 4th of July. I'll see you next time.